The leading scorer on the Missouri basketball team this season is only a sophomore, but Kim English isn't shy. He's taken almost 100 more shots than anyone else on the team this season, but if it wasn't for a childhood problem, he might not even be playing at all. Tie game, seconds left. Kim English at the free throw line. If you want crunch time, here it is. When it comes to hoops, Kim English has no hesitation. That's great effort by English. And he doesn't pause when projecting his play. Effortless. Smooth. Prolific. The greatest ever. When I'm all done, not now. His confidence projects clearly. I mean, anybody that knows him knows that he thinks highly of himself, and rightfully so. English is more than just the mouth of the Mizzou basketball team. He's also one of the emotional leaders. During a game, you can find him pumping fists, slapping fives, and landing in laps. He's a guy, you know, that gives everything he has when he steps on the floor, you know, and just the, the motion, you know, you see out of him, it kind of, you know, amps you up yourself. But English hasn't always found it easy to express himself. Bang from several steps beyond the line. I had a girl name and I studied. So that was like a lose-lose situation. First, everybody laughing because a boy named Kim. Then everybody laughing that I can't even get my name out. I mean, kids are going to be kids, and that's, that's part of life. And I think it makes it stronger. And I think it made him stronger. Strength English says he needed while growing up with a speech impediment. He says he can't watch an online interview from when he was in high school. So it was nice to just, just come here and put on a show for the fans who haven't, who haven't seen me in a year. He's asking a question about Missouri and I'm stuttering crazy. Like being, being from Baltimore and the under a dog, you want to like help establish a program. So he credits basketball so with rewriting his life and he didn't start that chapter until he was 13 years old. I picked up basketball because I could just play. I didn't have to do too much talking. Like when you're outside playing, you got to do a lot of talking. You talk who the baddest, talk who that's, talk who that, but in basketball, you just play. So he played and practiced basketball and talking. For English, they are a lot alike. You got to like practice talking. Like just talk, read a book out loud. Or Say whatever you hear said on the radio, just say it again. Just talk to your mother, talk to your father. And those free throws, he made them. It is, the young man calmly hits. Because practice makes perfect. I mean, God gave me a mouth, gave me a voice. I'm going to use it. About 10.5 million people in the United States live with a stutter. Statistics show three out of four kids with a stutter will eventually grow out of it. Back to you.